The most important thing is public safety and the health of our country. And that's why, as we go forward, we've been uh, very cautious. We've been following the science and observing social distancing. But I am very optimistic about the, the opening up that's going to happen tomorrow. I've been talking to the staff here in juice bars, shoe shops, M&S, everywhere. Uh, and they're very excited. They've done a huge amount of work. I, I, they're not sure quite what they're going to get tomorrow. Will they get you know, a huge wave of customers? Will it be a trickle? Uh, we don't know. But I think people should shop and shop uh, with confidence, but they should, of course, observe the rules on social distancing and do it safely as well. Well, what we've said is that nobody should be penalised uh, in this country for, for doing the right thing, for, uh, for staying at home, protecting the NHS and saving lives. And actually, quite amazing talking to the staff here, talking to people who've been working here. They do really understand and appreciate the value of the furlough scheme. A lot of them have been furloughed. They're now coming back on. Obviously, we hope that as many people as possible will start to come back on. But furlough, don't forget, does go on uh, until... October, uh, but we want gradually to get things moving. But the priority, I must stress, Kate, the priority is controlling the virus, beating it, and uh, making sure it all can be done safely.